Understanding Corporate Censorship, A Beginner's Guide. Hello and welcome. Today, we're diving into a fascinating and increasingly relevant topic, corporate censorship. This concept might sound complex, but it's something that affects the information we access, the media we consume, and the freedom of expression in our daily lives. Let's explore what corporate censorship means and why it matters to all of us. Corporate censorship refers to the practice of corporations limiting or controlling the information that is published or broadcasted through the media and online platforms they own or influence. Unlike government censorship, which involves state intervention, corporate censorship is driven by private entities and their interests. This can include suppressing negative information about themselves, promoting content that aligns with their values, or even influencing public opinion on various matters. To better understand corporate censorship, let's look at a few examples. A social media platform removing or restricting content that conflicts with its community standards or advertising policies. A news outlet avoiding coverage of sensitive issues that might offend its advertisers or owners. Online platforms algorithmically filtering information to prioritize certain viewpoints or products. These examples show how corporate censorship can shape the information landscape, influencing what we see, read, and believe. The implications of corporate censorship are vast and multifaceted. Freedom of speech. At its core, corporate censorship can challenge the principle of free speech by limiting diverse voices and perspectives. Public discourse. It can alter public discourse by controlling which topics are deemed acceptable for discussion. Consumer awareness. Corporate censorship can impact consumer awareness by hiding negative information about products or services. Understanding these implications helps us recognize the importance of transparency and accountability in corporate practices. Corporate censorship is a complex issue that sits at the intersection of business interests, media ethics, and individual rights. By being aware of it, we can better navigate the media landscape, critically assess the information we encounter, and advocate for a more open and equitable exchange of ideas. Thank you for joining me in exploring this topic. I hope this video has shed light on the concept of corporate censorship and its impact on our society.